is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update. We're looking at the Dow up 116 to 33,083. It was really important that over the last three days we keep testing the 33,000 level. And if we can get through tomorrow at 10 a.m., 10.30 a.m. when the uh, Powell has his Fed speak, we're, that'll be fantastic. All I can say is that we've used up quite a bit of time on this de decline from the 16th of August high of 34,281. It's really important that somehow we hold the 32,500s over the next week if there's any sharp sell-off. And it'll be fantastic if there's a, a nice rally today and then it gives you a cushion for whatever happens tomorrow. Because look, we're even having a very nice rally. The Dow's up 117, the S&P is up 32, up 0.79% uh, at 4173 getting towards the uh, 4191 200 period exponential moving average. Uh, the most important thing is it's pushing higher to be able to raise the base of support if there's bad news tomorrow. One, two, three, there we go, QQQ. The QQQ at this particular moment is up 3.04, up 0.97%. That's nice, the 318.10. And we've got the IWM, the Russell 2000 small caps, having a very good move up 1.2%, up 235 and 194.74. That's a good sign. And if we look at gold, looking at gold, we've got gold that was a very sharp early in the morning. Now it's up six, still pretty good, uh, but it keeps getting pulled back. The, the repellent of the nine and the 14 period exponential moving average averages are very strong. And the dollar, which actually slipped a little bit overnight, is trading right now at... Uh, let's see. It's at 108.56, down 12 ticks. Uh, the, it made an almost exact double top. The dollar index 109.29 on the 19th of July, 109, 109, I think 27, three days ago. Uh, everything's strong enough to say it should push to a leg. See, we'll see what happens. Crude oil. Crude oil is up 10 cents at 94.99. Had a really strong rebound from the 200 period moving average in the 87, 86 area. Good move. And this is the thing that we've got to monitor over the next two sessions. Uh, the yields are unchanged at 111.33 in the TLT. And it did an exact pullback to the level of the 110s from a couple of months ago. I'll be back with the Tiger Technicians. Hello, Basil Chapman. Hoping that you can stay. Great program all day here at TFNet. Be back in a moment. Tiger Technicians.